be to last 28. Wayne Collins, raise your hand. Look right here. This is the guy who started all of this. This whole event is about friendship and good cheer and camaraderie. So this is Bonanza Dodge Cup. We're going to fly with 118 Bonanzas, yep. Barons, and Debonairs here from Rockford, Illinois to Oshkosh, Wisconsin. Check out the world's largest air show. It's going to be a blast. We're going to do the mass flight briefing now. Road leader briefings immediately after that out of the ramp. Then element briefings. And you should have about 20 to 30 minutes to finish your pre-flight and final loading. We'll try to start at 12.15 and then take off about 12.30 uh, to 12.45. 25 knots all the way to Florida. All 116 airplanes are going to pull their throttles to slow to 110 knots. So, unless you need to say something to avoid a collision, keep your mouth shut. And, uh, yeah, I guess this is what 118 airplane, 118, you know, bananas and barons on one ramp looks like. I'll crawl lights on, gear down after we turn the cobra and start the descent. And um, everybody will check each other's gear. And you can be assured that I'll have my gear down. Now, if I call my element, 7 1, element going around, I expect both of them to go with me. Weather might be a little bit of a problem. Uh, apparently, about halfway from here to Oshkosh, it's 900 overcast. So, the season's kind of like sending out a Baron to go scout the weather, report back, and you know, hopefully, we'll be out of here in about a half hour. Might just have to duck down a little bit lower below the clouds. So, we've been delayed a little bit longer. Uh, we sent out a Baron to go check the weather. Apparently, it was kind of low en route, uh, so we're delayed about another hour, but it looks like it's improving now, so I think we'll be out of here pretty soon. But in the meantime, just kind of lounging under the wing, having some snacks. Here we go. Look at this line of bonanzas. Look at all those on the runway already. This is just such an incredible sight. Wow. This is just awesome. So we're going to line up on the left today. We're the left wingman in a three uh, aircraft element. We just follow the conga line. Just hug the left side of the runway here, pull up behind these guys. They'll park us. You can really feel all the airflow here from tons and tons of airplanes ahead of us. And there we go. This is this is how we park. There's just nothing in the world like this. This is so amazing. So here we are on runway 25 today. We're lined up. We got 98 Bonanzas or Debonairs, probably a couple of those uh, included in that 98 figure. And then 18 Barons. We got 116 airplanes today. Whoever can't hear yourself is the one has a stuck mic. Are you turned on? Uh, I am now. Bonanza tail is in. Um, it is a... Uh, Bonanza lead control. copy. Which is the Looking for the traffic, 3 sector. Good afternoon, tower. Bonanza lead. Flight of 116, ready for takeoff 25. So Bonanza flight of 116, Rockford Tower, turn right on course, runway 25, intersection departure, clear for takeoff. Bonanza flight, cleared for takeoff. That's the coolest thing I've ever seen. Same here. And we are cleared for takeoff. It'll be a little bit before we actually take off, but uh, the, the whole flight is, is cleared for takeoff. Okay, so basically we just follow the lead. If anything goes crazy, the uh, go around is 
Yeah, you know, essentially stay out of everybody's way. So a right turn to climb to 2,000 on the uh, three sixes. One eight is also a uh, right turn. Three, yeah, it's 2,000, 2,000, except if we end up somehow landing runway nine, then it's 1,500. Element 2-2 two two rolling. I think I got all this. Oh, this is so cool. Two dash three rolling. So you can see each element climbing out there and making the right turn to the uh, Rockford VOR and then up to um, Element two dash Janesville. One. And then uh, I forget the other one, it's wherever the uh, Cessna is staged their thing. Uh, we'll fly over them. That's uh, Juneau, Wisconsin. Element two dash four. And then up to Oshkosh. This is the coolest thing in the whole world. Bonanza flight level 2,500. Level off 2,500. Okay, I'm going to close my window. Rockford Tower the rolling. Mixture is rich. Props full forward. Land, runway 1, 178. Okay, running up to uh, 1,700. And. Element 7, row 4, rolling. And of course, I'm sucked. All right, uh, who's over the Rockford VOR right now? Element 4-3. Four, 4-4, four, four, and I'm following 4-3. Traffic, 12 o'clock, same Element altitude, seven, two, zero miles. 7-1, right wingman, gear up. Element 5-1 is Rockford VOR, 4-1, gear up. Jiggling around a little bit there. Yeah, a lot of turbulence. I mean, there's so many planes what taking off. Away. This air here is just crazy. Look at all those planes ahead of us, though. That Such is an awesome so sight. cool. It, it looks like mayhem, but it's not. Baron two rolling. Well, thanks. So he's he's got us out pretty wide here, so yeah. we can get, get our spacing better. He knows what he's doing. I mean, we're, we're doing 100 knots, so I mean, I think we're on somebody else up ahead who's probably doing 100 miles an hour. So I think the problem on the uh, that first turn was that there's no waypoint there. It's just a right turn to the VOR, and so people were cutting the corner and stuff. And right. Just kept getting I tighter and tighter. So this is, this is B to Osh, so now we fly the, uh, four, three, I don't even know how many miles, I'm not even going to say, it's basically about an hour flight up to Oshkosh, because we only do 130 knots, uh, you need kind of a slower speed than normal to give some buffer so that you can, uh, stay in position real well. Basically, you know, just like a normal flight, we try to maintain essentially radio silence, you know, we just follow lead, lead follows the element in front of us. And, uh, you know, lead and tail kind of update their position, a couple other people here and there, so everybody knows where everybody's at. But uh, for the most part, it's just silence. It's peaceful. It's so much easier than the, uh, you know, the ribbon rip on fist, yeah. fist arrival. That, that madness. That meltdown hornet's nest. Yeah. Bonanza lead switching to Oshkosh Tower. Bonanza lead switching to Oshkosh Tower. 126.6. This is so awesome. Like, I can't think of a better way to spend an afternoon. Like, going to Oshkosh, doing it in a formation of 116 planes. Uh, is awesome. Is that you clearing Janesville? Yeah, so as we said, you know, in the training, this is not a gaggle. We stay nice and tight. We don't want to, you know, get lost and get sucked back into the next element behind us. And just keep it nice and tight, but still far enough out that it's not too intense for an hour-long flight. And it's nice and peaceful and calm, and we get to Oshkosh in a very orderly manner. Much better than the grip on Fisk arrival or you know, anything, any chaos like that. It's really cool in formation, you know, because you see the lead plane kind of start to wobble and you know that in a couple seconds you're going to have some turbulence. And uh, that's what we got here. Dodge County traffic. Bonanza, flight of 116. Long trail formation overflying your airport south to north for the next 20 minutes. Dodge County. So we're going to be flying over uh, the 
to like Dodge County Lead. for the uh, Cessnas uh, stage. It's also just awesome that you can get 120 airplanes somewhere right. with Without, no communication. Yeah, no communication. One guy talks to tower, and that's it. I mean, it's it's amazing. It's so peaceful. Bonanza lead. There's nothing else like it in the world. Oshkosh Tower, Bonanza, flight of 116, 20 miles south. I would prefer complete radio silence, except for absolutely necessary calls. Except for takeoff and landing. 24. Right. I mean, just just whatever you know, lead is talking to tower about. Better yet, even lead shouldn't talk to tower. <laughs> just go for Bonanza it. Just like that signal. Low to 110 in 15 seconds. Okay, we're gonna Bonanza slow down flight. here in 15 Bonanza seconds. Flight. Slow to 110 knots in 15 seconds. Bonanza flight, slow to 110 now, slow to 110 now. Bonanza flight, slow to 110 now, 110 now, Bonanza flight. Wind with the gear up, rock the wings. Wind with the gear up, rock the wings. Element 8 dash 1, Dodge Cannon. Oshkosh Tower, Bonanza flight is 10 miles. Bonanza flight, Roger, thanks. RV Paul, let's to land 3 6 right, the right side, narrow runway, narrow runway, 3 6 right. Bonanza flight, Roger, okay. through land runway 3 6 left and right, and if any of you need to go around, then make a right turn as soon as prior to to the east, remain south of the control tower at all times if you have to go around. Bonanza flight is cleared to land and go around. So basically they're going to stop arrivals now on the 36s and it's just going to be us for the next 20 minutes, 25 minutes. Lake Winnebago shoreline, number 410, Milford Field, will remain here east of the 36 left runways, we'll work you inbound. Traffic, 11 o'clock, same altitude, one mile. Yeah, right there. Okay, roger that. Uh, just hold on for the shoreline east of the tower, work you inbound in a little bit. Yeah, that's true. Uh, and so, uh, yeah, it's three. Still coming in down yeah, down we cannot cross you over them. I think he noticed what was going on last Yeah, time. yeah that's fine. Just remain east of the airport at all times. There's Lake Winnebago. And 5-1, lights on. Here now. Oshkosh Tower, Douglas 62, Charlie Charlie, Stars and Bars, C-47, 5 east of Fond du Lac, headed to Warbird Island. Delta 62 Charlie Charlie Oshkosh Tower, roger that. Proceed drive Warbird and hold over Warbird. We have both map arrival bonanzas. We'll keep you updated and get you about as soon as possible. Oshkosh Tower, bonanza tail is one element five dash four. Here down, down. lights on. Bonanza tail, thank you very much. And uh, Chinook, over and over the field. Uh, the last traffic does follow the 18 south of the field. We'll keep you advised with the progress, but they're 18 south. Element uh, 7 dash 3, you're down, lights on. Okay, and we're next. About 15 seconds or so. Element 7 4, gear down, lights on. Okay, we're going flaps. Okay, make sure the ridge props full forward. Here's 3 green. Yeah. Baron 3, gear down, lights on. Oh, hey, check out the Chinook hovering over there. Report to Warbird. Oh, sweet. Hold there, we have a mass awesome. rifle bonanza. Can you verify the call sign? 87745, we'll plan to hold Warbird. Baron 4, gear down. 87745, thanks. Douglas 87745, use caution for multiple aircraft holding at uh, Warbird Island. You'll see an additional focus Traffic, over there as well. 11 o'clock. Same altitude, less than one mile. Thanks, yeah, the Bonanza flight to mass arrival, they're about uh, 11 to 12 miles out. That's the last tail aircraft. Nice. Keep the speed up, but we gotta be able to follow him.
Bonanza tail gear is down. Yeah, that's one. Seven or eight I've been told five minutes actually. some uh, awards to give out to Joel Nichols, who flew the entire flight year down. You win the Shell Oil Customer of the Year Award. <laughs> So much more peaceful and way easier than the regular arrival to get in here where you just have to go out and find some random airplane, stay like a half mile behind them, chaos. And really like all of aviation, it's all about the people. You just got some awesome people, a great time. And now we'll check out the rest of the week. <laughs> 